This episode is brought to you by our farm investor, Clint Bowman. Thanks for being part of Andy's farm. All right, farmers, welcome back to Ravenport. Now, we have got a, I'm going to say a situation. And that's the best way of describing it, because all of me animals, yeah, they're either really low on food or they've got no food at all. So me chickens have only got 500 litres left. And to be fair... We, we've, we've run out of space on the eggs pallets as well so we need to move those my cows have got no food which is <laughs> not great either and neither is my sheep mm, indeed but having a look at the old deeds to the farm this area up the back over past this field this is all mine as well so i could mow this grass because i know we took a lot out of the grass situation by expanding the big field over there I can mow up here. I mean, if we have a look at the map. Right, let's go back into the map. There you are. So, I'm all the way up here. So, it's like past this tree line. And then over the road a little bit. I mean, to be fair, over the road a little bit is just... It's just rocks and cliffs. So, really, up to here, it's all mowable. I mean, let, let's not... <laughs> let's not beat about the bush. It's not exactly flat. So, it's going to be interesting. But we can sort of get some grass over here. And the bits that we had before. So I'm thinking, yeah, we get this mowing on the go. All right, let's get cracking. And to be fair, uh, our pineapple greenhouses, they're, uh, they're empty as well. Everything needs filling up. Oh, I think we with the race to get the, was it, the corn that we put in. Yeah, I think everything else has been left a little bit. So we've got a lot of tidying up to do, catching up. So first off, we're going to get the grass done.
Right, so I've got the bales done and to, to be fair, right, three bales high. Yeah, that, that's a bit precarious, I must admit. But we're here. We're here with the sheep, the bales are done right. So I reckon, right, rather than just unload them, handball them, what if we back the trailer in? I'm not sure if the three bales high is going to get through the door, mind you, but the first lot should. We'll find out. Let's give it a go. Right, it's so 84,000 litres. Can't do that. Let's put the... Oh, it's, it's going. 34,000 litres left. Right, okay. So let's see what... Uh, is, that, is that my neck full up? Where's my sheep? Oh, there you are. There's my sheep. Oh, it only takes 50,000 litres. Right, okay. So we're going to have to put these into our pallet and bale storage facility. Now, we need to move on. Obviously, that's the first job done. Cows, they need some food. Right, not a problem. We'll chuck some straw in whilst we're up here. And then also, we need to take the wool down to the fabric shop. We need to put some manure and water into the greenhouses. We need to get some more food for the chickens as well. And then we also need to move those eggs. Yeah, that's that's the, that's the next round of jobs anyway. We'll put it that way. All right, let's get cracking with that then. So with that going in, I, mean, I think we won't fill that one completely up, so it leaves our trailer empty anyway, that's always a good idea. With that done, we're done for the day. 
I mean, we haven't made any money today. I, I, yeah, I admit that. We haven't. Because we, have, we haven't sold anything off. But obviously, some days you don't make money. Some days it's all about the prep ready for the good days and that's one of those days we've had today when I mean, we got the sheep fed we got the cows fed we got the chickens fed we got some stuff chucked into our bale and pallet storage facility so it's all shaping up nicely for a more profitable day but we're done all right today though we got some jobs done ah fair enough so if you enjoyed this episode why not go and treat yourself to some andy's farm merch link in the description below and whilst you're down there why not hit the join button come join us on andy's farm and if you haven't already hit the subscribe button it's muchly appreciated but for me that's it for today and i'll see you in the next one